What's up guys? Welcome back to Ride the Bean. Today I am uh, back with Christian and uh, I'm gonna change tires on my bike for the first time. I have uh, bought the new Mitas E10s. So uh, let's see if we can manage to put them on. Hopefully. <laughs> this place is uh, a pretty cool place. It's, uh, it's part of the Nuff MC club. It's like a, a motorcycle club for anyone. Well, anyone, yeah. All cycles. Yeah, so uh, this, is like a, uh, this is like a clubhouse and they have a workshop in the back where you can uh, play around on your bike and fix things and talk to people and all of that. We're here alone today, so uh, we have the whole place to ourselves. So now I just gotta get my bike in that door. Let's see if <laughs> if that works. <laughs> You're too fat! <laughs> I think he's got Vaseline, so he's a frequent user of uh, Vaseline. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> There we go. Yes. Awesome. Now it's just the rest. This place is pretty cool. Here, anyone can come and uh, play around on their bikes. Uh, uh, anyone member. Any member. Yeah, member. that's true. <laughs> I have to be a member. Maybe you have access to all kinds of tools and equipment and everything. It's pretty nice. Oil filter. Oh. Oil. I should also change some oil, but we'll see what we have time for today. I'm going to change this oil in 2,000 kilometers. <laughs> this is my tool roll. I've changed tires once on my old XT, but never on this one. But as you can see, <laughs> These are, these are the original tires, they've gone uh, about 12,000 kilometers now, so I think it's time for <laughs> a change. Elias knows how the ABS works. Then I go to the traction control, ABS, I don't have any traction control. <laughs> it's just ABS. Yeah, you will lose ABS with uh, this muscle. Let's try the bead breakers first. Yeah. Because this is what I have to do if I have a flash in the field. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Bring on the big guns. <laughs> there are no guns. It's just these shooters. <laughs> Fish cakes. <laughs> <laughs> Why is this so damn hard? Så 
Hvis du er på der, er det værd at gå i 26 mil af en civilisation. Okay, fuck it. Let's, let's just do the simple way. I know the theory. Yeah. Right. This is so much easier. Yeah. <laughs> I need to bring one of these. <laughs> You can buy a BMW GS and you can have one of these on behind. You can have it on an extra button. <laughs> so, after tips from Thomas Hansen, we lube it up. Lube it up. Right, Thomas? Lube it. Lots of lube. Lots of lube. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what do we call it? Dirty Boy Thomas Hansen trick. <laughs> Ah. Not bad? Yeah, <laughs> cool luck. Good job. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> so this is the new rear tire. I don't really know anything about tires whatsoever. But I hear people say this is a good one, the Mitas Defense. So, I trust that. Let's see if we can put it on. We have to do the first trick. Lube lube? Yes, <laughs> lots of lube. <laughs> Going in tight corners. <laughs> <laughs> I tried mounting a tire without any lube once. Didn't work very well. No? Yeah. <laughs> I got a good exercise of that. <laughs> Next is uh, your uh, tube. Stand up on. Perfect. Voila. Nice. Yeah. Well, I got it on. One down, one to go. Looks like we don't have time to do uh, the front wheel today, so uh, we're gonna have to come back tomorrow to do that. But we do have time to change some oil. I have never done this before either, so this is also new experience before me. For me, it's uh, always interesting to learn. We're taking out this. When you open this, the oil will come like have a. A beam all the way down here. You have to uh, hit this one. Oh. Okay. Let's move it to a hand pump. I'm gonna pop. Pop it. Yeah, shit happens. Is that the gasket? Yes. And you need to change that every time as well? Yeah. If you have a um, copper gasket, you can heat the gasket up till it's uh, red glowing with a heat gun. And it will be like new because it's copper. That kind of thing. How about net pot? So this should only be tightened by hand. Yeah. You don't need to. No. It is like yeah, it's fairly tight. If you tighten it, all you can do, you will never get it off again. And the correct Newton for that bolt, it is um, engine engine oil drain bolt. That's forty three Newton. My first oil change. To always go over a bolt. Like put your finger on every bolt to check if that you have mounted it. So it's which uh, which bolt? The oil drain plug. We both know you did it. But, yeah. Uh, and the filter. It's a, good, it's a good habit to have that you always put your finger on it because yes, I did this. Yes, I did this. Yes, I did this. One day you will forget it and you will forget <laughs> it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, well, I think I think uh, that was it for today. Uh, we're, <laughs> we're gonna have to go come back here tomorrow to change the front wheel, front tire. But, until, uh, until tomorrow. Until tomorrow. Be back at the workshop to take off the front wheel 
and uh, yeah, let's see how that goes. Start the day with some coffee. Oh. That was it for uh, for today. I managed to f to change the tire. Uh, so now both tires are new, new E tens and uh, new oil. So it's gonna be interesting to see what the bike feels like now. I hope you enjoyed this video. It was, <laughs> it was a little bit of a strange one, but uh, good fun. Good fun. Yes. <laughs> so uh, thank you for watching, and uh, I'll see you next time. Peace. <laughs> oh, Peace. by the way, Christian <laughs> gave, gave me a gift. <laughs> so I had to give him a gift because he was slim enough to use it. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't even know. Or you're gonna what get so this? many dates. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit tight. <laughs> but I think this will work. <laughs> Now I just gotta get the bike out and see if this one works. <laughs> Guaranteed. <laughs>